crochet these in and do the front as the individuals. too tight but taunt okay so it has to have a good grip because you want to be able to cover the base so and I keep stretching out the hair because I want every I want the hair to be neat I'm just gonna keep wrapping flat and the more I wrap flat and taunt it's going to give me the effect of it being 
identical to the rest of the locks that are crocheted in the back. If the hair glue if I still have enough hair glue on here let me just make sure okay so I have enough hair glue just dab it there and then I'm going to proceed to wrap back up a little bit of spray holding spray I'm using the the dots to be and then I'm going to use my blow dryer <coughs> to seal it in I have it on just kind of gives it like that seamless look now if there's any little flyaways I just cut it away just any flyaways at all I just cut it away and that's how um, that's how I conceal the <clears throat> the hair River locks and they're from the model model hair company and just take a look at how beautiful these locks are you guys and it has like a light um, wave to the lock itself and then this deep wave curl comes out at like certain like different parts of the lock so it kind of gives it like that whole bohemian look to this lock and this is the part where the crochet is and it's 14 inches in length and the bottom has that little kind of like body wave curl at the bottom and the two curls coming out of it throughout the hair strand um, when I saw this hair I thought that this hair was so bomb because usually when I'm doing locks I would have to already get um, the deep wave curl and put it into the hair but it already has this into the hair already it already made it like that you know um because you i think i did a video before on my channel where i did the lock and i pulled out curly pieces into the hair where you don't have to do that it's actually in the lock itself already so that is that's even better you know i bought four packs of this hair i still have a lot of hair left over which is a good thing because if one of the hair gets really ratty you can always replace it with the leftover hair that you have so it's always good to have extra hair so four packs of hair will definitely give you a full install as you know I did the front perimeter in the individuals and I did the knotless method and I used the rubber band as well because my hair is super short and that's to secure that the hair will not fall out if your hair is a little bit longer I would recommend just braiding your hair into the crochet lock and then doing the wrap with the um with the Marley hair I actually like this hair it's very lightweight 
um, it's giving me carefree vibes. It's very low maintenance. I love how um, naturalistic this hair looks. I love the curls coming through the locks. So it's giving me a lot of like that whole island boho vibe look, but it's very classy. It took me two hours to do the install, which is great. And granted, time is money as well. So you have to think about like, do you want to do these um, locks? And pay somebody like $300, $400 to get these installed when you paid $40. I paid $40 for this hair and it took me two hours to do this install. So I am like really loving this look. And I wanted to do a close up on my hairline so I can show you that doing the partial individual method still gives you that versatility and it still gives you the look of all individuals. So let me just uh, shoot a shot at the hairline. I did go ahead and lay down my baby hairs with the um, bottle of um, got to be glued gel and um, so yeah so my baby hairs are laid down and so here's a shot of the front so I have two rows of individuals in the front as you can see and it just kind of conceals those the cornrows towards the middle and even though I have cornrows in the middle you really can't tell unless you come really close up to my hair I'm going to show you, uh, show you a view from the back as well with the hair. So like I said, the hair is 14 inches and um, for me, it just hits me right below the shoulder. So it's definitely giving me, um, not bob, but lob. Because if it was a bob, it would be above my shoulder. So this is more like a lob. I swung my hair over to this side, but it's so versatile. I can wear it in the middle. I can wear it from this side or that side. And the styling options are, um, you know, you get a lot. You get a lot of styling options with this look. I can wear it in like a half bun up here, and everything coming down. I bought this hair with my own money, so this is not a sponsored video. But I will definitely leave a link to an online vendor um, if you're interested in purchasing this hair. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please definitely like, subscribe, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think of this hair. Would you try it? And I'm also on Instagram, so you can definitely tag me if you uh, did install this hair. I would love to see your photos and things like that on Instagram. My Instagram is under my name, Kim Naima. So you'll definitely find me there. Until my next video, as always be blessed and I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye guys.